I'm Desmond Majakulami, the founder of Lufasi Park. I like to call myself a creation carer, sometimes known as an environmental activist. It doesn't bite, it doesn't have feet. At Lufasi, I'm kind of like the, the, the chief gardener. We do strategize and coordinate activities for the park, which is geared towards creating awareness about the utmost need to look after the environment. The children that come here, haven't, they haven't been exposed to much green space, let alone a little wildlife sanctuary like this. The first thing we tell the children when they come, the most important thing you can do is protecting nature. You know, when your house is on fire, you don't really want to spend too much time just debating about it. So what we want for people like you is to support nature. We want you to fight for nature. 50 years ago, uh, Lagos was a very, very green city. There was not a densely populated area at all. But what manifested was that same human characteristic that has been manifesting all over the world was greed. The technology came on with people globally and of course with Africans and Nigerians. We started using this technology in pursuit of those negative goals and characteristics. And the thing about nature is, uh, you know, while God can forgive all the time, man can forgive some of the time, nature doesn't have that capacity. Nature will give you whatever you give her. Fundamental laws. And this operates in the, in the microscopic right up to the cosmic law of action and reaction. In Nigeria and, and, and in Africa, we have uh, far more reverence for our God, for the Creator. And we're getting a pretty good reception from some of the faith leaders. And the scriptures are very, very clear. There's no ambiguity. And um, we should love the God by loving His creation. We've been working with um, uh, Nigeria Info 99.3 for ooh, a few years now. The show started as, it was called Green Hour, and then it transmorphed into a, the Environment Report. And this, this is a, a short half hour program where we just, you know, bring out the various topics, like, you know, when we have World Biodiversity Day, we talk about the importance of the biodiversity, and we just use it as a avenue to sensitize people. And the responses have been you know, very, very encouraging. And getting inspired. God bless you. Peace and love to you all. Bless you. Thank you very much, Desmond. We have to have a renewal of our minds that will transform us into more caring, more compassionate, more loving personalities.